Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 15 in chapter 14. Chapter 14 is about oscillations. In this one, we have a vertical spring. Right, the constant is given. Amplitude is given. Mass of the object is given. So first one, we, we consider when it has with the mass this position as y naught. So that means at the initial, at the time t equal to zero, at the initial, the position is zero. And it is just at the balanced point. So now we need to write the equation to describe this simple harmonic motion. So how can we do that? Of course, this is a sine function, agree? Okay? Because it starts at the balanced point. So we write a sine omega t. And there we can see the a is given. So we, it looks like we need to find omega. Omega is angular velocity equal to k over ms. Right? So you can see k and mass are given, so you can get answer there. Now we input omega and a, we get a function for the time t as a simple harmonic motion. The second time ask you what time will the spring be longest and shortest. So the spring be longest is the spring reaches to this point position, right? Agree? So this is ever a quarter of a t in ever period, right? So a quarter of a t, it moves to there, and plus nt because this uh, oscillation do multiple multiple period. So at ever, at each circle is uh, t over four, right? So you input the t inside, you get answer there. The next one, the spring becomes the shortest. So the spring moves to there maximum, and then return to balanced point and then up. This is the uh, shortest of the spring. The shortest of a spring, you can say, is a quarter of the t, quarter of the t, quarter of the t, three quarters of the t, plus the ever circle, nt, right? Now we look at the t, is 2 pi over omega. Then we input the t inside, get the final answer there. Thank you.